Hello. Today I have some 1989 classic WWF 15 collectible wrestling cards, series one. Pretty cool. Includes one logo card. Collect all ten and win. We will look at that on the back. I got these from a uh, sports card swap meet, I guess you could call it, here in uh, Portland, Oregon, at the Mall 205. They have it once a month, and every so often I find things because I don't collect sports cards, but I do collect other ones. And uh, I had these when I was a kid. These are pretty awesome. He had a stack of these, he wanted two bucks each. I uh, offered him three for five. Didn't really think about it till after I got home, but I should have bought all of them because these are pretty awesome. Right there on the back, you can see it says 1989, uh, Georgia. One thing I found interesting was it says Hulk Hogan, WrestleMania. Hogan rules are trademarks of the Marvel con comic group licensed exclusively to. So that's pretty cool that apparently Marvel Comics owns Hulk Hogan. I'm not sure. I haven't uh, researched that, but if that's the truth, I wonder if Disney owns. has something to do with Hulk Hogan. If anyone knows anything about that, or even if that was just at this time period, let me know in the comments below. So I'm really curious. But here's top back of the card. Be cool to get the uh, Hogan rules or even the uh, Honky Tonk Man. Pretty cool. Brutus, Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Pretty cool. Ultimate Warrior would be really cool. So. That's the packaging. Let's get these guys cracked open and see exactly what's inside. Okay, so I have them all cracked open. I haven't looked at any of them. I am waiting to do that with you guys. Let's do the first pack. I'll go through each card and I will show you guys exactly what we got. So, nice, right off the bat. We got ourselves a Hulk Hogan. Awesome. Here's the back of it. So it shows like a bio where he's from. Famous move. That's pretty cool. This is number one. And then you also got Big Boss Man. Again with the back, his bio. Here is Ravishing Rick Rude. These are actually really cool. Right here we have Macho Man. Ultimate Warrior. That's pretty awesome. Ooh, this next one's really, really cool. Here's Demolition. Oh, that's badass right there. I used to love those guys when I was a kid. Sucks they can't be in the games anymore since they were part of that lawsuit. Jake the Snake, that's pretty cool. We got the Million Dollar Man. Jigsaw, Hacksaw Jim Duggan, awesome. Andre the Giant, this is just an awesome pack overall. And then you got Miss Elizabeth. Bruce the Beefcake. It's 15 cards in each pack. Ah, nice. Ready Piper. Jimmy Suka is next. And then Queen. Or not Queen. It was Miss Elizabeth. I'm not sure if she's a Queen or not. I think she's just Miss Elizabeth. Well, that, I'm not going to lie, is a pretty awesome pack. I, uh, very satisfied with that. Dollar 33 I spent on this. I'm not sure if these are actually worth anything. I'm assuming they are. So here's the next pack. Right off the bat, Jimmy Hart. Nice, nice. 
Honky Tonk Man. Dino Bravo. Wait, is there one behind that too? I mean, I missed one. Oh. Look, I never cared for that guy. Never cared for him either. Red Rooster. I honestly have no clue who that is. Swift. I have no clue who that is. Paul Roma. No clue who that is. Oh, Mean Gene Oakland. No. I don't know who this is. Jesse Body Ventura. Nice. Oh, cool. Macho Badness. Tax Demolition. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be going back to the same spot. I mean, they have it once a month. I'm definitely going to be going back there and buying the rest of these cards. These are awesome. And you got Cowardly Wave. You got, I believe this is a first double. Ultimate Warrior. Oh, this is cool. Cool to get these autographs, actually. The Rockers. Good old Shawn Michaels and... I can't remember his name. And the Ultimate Warrior sticker. That's pretty cool, too. Well, my $5 is well spent so far. Now... Right, let's do this. This seems to be easier. Another different Ultimate Warrior. Nice. Nice. Hockey Talk. I think it's our, another uh, second one there. Double. Let's see, we got Hit the Man, Broke Hit Man Heart. Nice, nice. And right behind that, you got Anvil Heart. Cool. And then behind that, you got the Bushwhackers. Oh, that's pretty awesome right there. And here, this is definitely a hey. double. No clue who that is. Barry Hart's not sure. Here's the Brooklyn Baller. I don't remember that one either. Nice. So this is actually kind of a nice double. Mean Gene. Mean, I don't know who that is. Here is a Jesse Ventura. Another double. Sean Mooney. Nice, nice. <laughs> we got the referee. That's funny. Larry Davis. We got good old Jack. And one more behind it. Oh, and another Ultra Warrior sticker. Cool. I actually might pop a couple of these on eBay and see if I can get something for them and maybe buy some other older wrestling packs. So, there we are. That was pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. I uh, will definitely be picking up more of these at the next convention show, whatever you want to call it, and uh, doing another one of these videos. Until next time, happy hunting and have a good night, and uh, don't forget to subscribe and let me know about that Hogan question with the trademark with Marvel.